Hey everybody, I got the SA Sports Empire Dragon out today. This would be the second video I've done on this, or actually second shooting video I should say. Uh, it shoots at uh, 345 feet per second. That's what the factory arrow, um, mine's going to shoot a little less because I have about a 407 grain total arrow with the 100 grain tip on it, that's included. And that is the Nap Thunderhead 100 grain. Uh, fixed blade, cut on contact, same thing. Um, but I wanted to get this out and get it ready for deer season because it's right around the corner here in Indiana. Today is September 14th and deer season starts October 1st for us, archery season. So I wanted to get this out and get it sighted in and dialed in and I want to show you how accurate it is at 40 yards. So uh, my little setup here, I'm using, I'm using a tripod with a little shooting stick yoke on it and then I'm shooting about 40 yards at the target down there and I switched the target around to be uh, on the brand new side because I, I try to rotate as much as possible, especially with broadheads, you're going to wear the target out. So. Let me go ahead and get the bow cocked and ready, and we'll get shooting for you. And I'm only going to shoot one, this one bolt at a time because um, it gets kind of pricey, as accurate as these bows are. If you keep robin hooding or uh, cutting the veins, especially using broadheads. So I'll show you that I can probably hit about the same spot two times in a row, well at least one shot after the other I'm gonna shoot twice and uh, I'll show you that downrange but like I said I'm only gonna shoot this same arrow so or same bolt I'm not gonna sh go get another one so all right let's get the bow cocked All right, I'll take you guys down here to show you where I hit the first time, and then we'll pull it out and do it all over again.
I'd say the bow was pretty well on for 40 yards. And I was aiming dead center. So, I mean, for an arrow at 40 yards. But I'm going to pull this out real quick and then I'll head back down. All right, everybody. This is the second shot at 40 yards. Bugs around me, flies, or whatever they are, gnats. Let's go down here and show you. All right guys, well, I pretty much clipped the first hole. I didn't get it exactly in the same spot, but I'm not complaining if we're not shooting off a bench. I mean, this is, that's how big that target is at 40 yards. Um, so I'd say I'm on for deer. And uh, the SA Sports Empire Dragon is a really accurate bow. So, I mean, if I wanted to do the bench, I could have, but I'd rather do the more real life scenario where you know I want to be standing up in the woods or walking or shooting off my tree stand I'm not going to have that bench with me so I would say I'm on for 40 yards just to show you how far about halfway down the yard so alrighty well I appreciate everybody watching um, I'm going to grab my arrow here and or my bolt and if you want to know how this is that accurate let me show you real quick before I let you go and get my bolt out of here I actually posted a video on this over the winter and um, it really works big time so if you see your broadhead here three bladed this is what I use three blades you know a lot of people use the, the broadheads that actually fly like a field point well that's fine but I still make sure that they fly like that since I have these style of broadheads you can actually tune them into your fletching and what I mean by that is you align your fletching up for the per blade on the broadhead and it actually flies a lot straighter instead of wiggly or zig zigzagging through the air basically so if you can see that I got it lined up as much as possible and to do that if your broadhead doesn't screw in like that and align perfectly what I did was I took a sharpening a knife sharpening stone and polished the insert on my arrow and use your wrench and tighten it or loosen or basically tighten as much as you can to get it to match your fletching and you're going to be shooting straight all day long and as you've seen at 40 yards just off offhand rest not even a bench rest I was pretty close I mean I was like that much off the same hole of the first shot so like I said dead deer 40 yards wherever I aim is where this bolt's going so within 40 yards or, or closer so i want to thank everybody for watching again 
Um, hope this helps, and uh, I know a lot of people have been asking me about making more crossbow videos, so here you go. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you on the next one.